Hey guys, welcome back to the game replay. I'm David the Usher. The game we're playing is Final Fantasy X for the Sony PlayStation 2. Okay, here we are. Ooh. Imagine if you had to walk past this wall. That's something. Yeah. So, at the end of the last video, we were uh, revealed uh, some startling news, I suppose you could say. It was crazy. Scenery right here is kind of cool, by the way. <laughs> Scenery is pretty odd and strange right here, by the way. Look at all them bodies. They're holding up the wall. Hold that wall up. Keep doing it. Do it for, I don't know, a couple more millennia. Anyway, things are getting crazy. There's twists and turns. There's twists around every turn. You don't know what's going to happen next. Ah. A big old cave. Okay, so a cave happens next. All right, uh, this place isn't... It's it's not too bad, I suppose. A couple of interesting, tough opponents here, though. Like, the big giant blob. I really hate fighting this thing, if I recall right. I don't know. You definitely need to be powered up to deal with these uh, annoying creatures. And uh, also, it's good to level up here, so if you want to do some battling. Might have been an Albed Primer there in the past. I can't really recall anymore. Look at that hole. Oop. Uh. Yeah, so we gotta go down a couple of these tunnels and do a couple things, and then, you know, there's some chests to collect along the way. So, uh, it's pretty much going uh, there and back, and then back again. I can't remember if this plays a part into anything, though, right there. So we gotta get by that hole. Oh, and there's a hole right, well, right there to the right of me. Ah, yeah. Former bosses becoming regular enemies now. Okay. So we're just gonna go down this tunnel. Ooh, look at the pretty colors. It's trippy. Let's go to the colors. Oh, hello. Recolored enemies. Yep, yeah, they're back. Recolored, again. I suppose fighting these guys, it's not that bad. The eyeball can be kind of a pain. Looks like we got a job to do, yeah? If anything should happen in the water, we're relying on you three. If it gets dangerous, pull out quick. Right. Be careful, okay? Yeah, I'm doing the water stuff. Titus, Riku, and Waka, always doing the water activities. Well, I just couldn't see the others doing this kind of thing, you know? It just wouldn't look right. Could you see Orin swimming around this water? That would look very bizarre, don't you think? I couldn't imagine it. I suppose I could kind of see Kamari floating around here in the water. But not Orin or Lulu. That would just look silly. It looks like I uh, decided I would uh, take on these creatures. Oh, damn it, Titus. Ha ha! He's got that water sword on. Damn that water sword. It makes Titus, like, next to useless down here. Oh, come on, Riku. Really? Really? You couldn't finish that? Well, Titus, what can you do for us, then? Yeah? Oh, he's poison, too. This is what happens, folks. This is what happens when I don't flee. It would take, like, two seconds. I like that. Might as well mug. Uh-oh, he's charging. Titus, are you okay? You're poisoned. Now walk is poisoned. All right, good stuff, you finished him. Yeah, man. I got poisoned, yeah? You sure did. Ugh, 
Okay, uh, I'm gonna use potions! Good lord. Okay, so it's not too bad. Well, it's not too bad if you skip a lot of these random battles. Only do the random battles if you're gonna do the leveling. Oh, what's this thing? It looks crazy! The first trial of Gagazat! Aim for the center with Waka's ball. Okay, so, uh, so do you get it? I gotta throw the ball and hit the little circle light thing on the inside. There's a pattern to this, you know, even if I get it through the hole, there's, uh, there's shit that moves around and covers it up on the inside. So let's see, I believe this will be the clear one, yeah. Okay, now you gotta wait. One. Two. Okay, coming up on the next one. Here we go. Oh, come on! Oh, it's too late. Just a little too late. Alright, is this number two? Okay, here comes the third. Come on! Oh, that's that's too late again. Strike two, Waka. And me. Alright, let's try and get it this time. Ready? Here we go. Here's the third. Here's the third. Here we go. And the pitch. Damn it! Too late again. This time, I'm gonna try and strike a little early. This goddamn thing. Here we go. Yes! Ha ha! Uh, well, don't leave too soon. I want to get that chest. Yay! <laughs> Took me four times to hit it. Should get a level four key sphere. Yeah. If you uh, if you hit that thing in the first try, you should get a level one. Two tries, a level two key sphere. Three, a three. That's how they should do it. What happens if it takes you five times? Ugh. Goodbye! <laughs> Bye! See you later. Okay, so we dealt with that. Oh, but what's this? Ugh. I shouldn't even bother right now. That leads to a dead end. Oh, I didn't want to steal. See, this is kind of annoying. I'm used to Titus going first, but because Riku has to be in the party now, because we're in the water, she will go first because she's the quickest. So as you can see, that leads to a dead end. It's a dead end, Dave. Hmm. Let's swim back. And there's a couple more of these tunnels. And as you could uh, figure out, you know, that's trial number one here at Gagazet. So we're not done with them. They're really not that complicated, though. Okay, so... Can I get out of here? Thanks. Ugh, I'm gonna have to go back. Alright. We're gonna head back to the save sphere, and then we're gonna take another one of the paths. I'm out of the water now, so I could call uh, anyone into the party that I want. Well, what's the point? What's the use? What does it matter? Oh, ambushed, great. All right, do what you will. Let me go. Ugh. Live and let live. Okay, so I think I'm gonna go down the right side Ugh, first. I believe in the last part I talked about that uh, accessory from FF6. I talk a lot. I talk about that accessory a lot, don't I? It'd be nice to have one. <clears throat> okay, okie dokie. Oh, wait a minute. No, not yet. Mm. We're gonna go left, then. How about left? Left sounds fine, then, doesn't it? I mean, the funny thing is, the area isn't that big. It's not. It's like a couple passages, like I said, but you're here for, like... I don't know. What, what do you guys think? Uh, we'll be here for 20 minutes? 
Oh, these guys. Man, a lot of ambushing going on, don't you think? Psych up! Don't do that! Psych down! I'm gonna steal your soul spring. It's good stealing soul springs. You can always, uh, I mean, I talk about leveling up. You can always steal level up. There's always items to steal, some of which can be uh, useful, and you can upgrade weapons and equipment with them. I, I don't have the patience for that. That's insanity stuff. I mean, these games... Everyone who plays these games are a little crazy. A little mad. A little touched in the head. Sometimes Waka will go in front of Titus, and when that happens, I am just like, what? How does how does something like this happen? This is intolerable. That's intolerable, too. Uh, am I really gonna go back through the original passage, through the water, again? See, after we unlock some of this stuff... Ugh, God. We can, uh, obtain some treasure chests. By the way, at the end of the last video, there was one of those crests in a treasure chest... ...on the left side of Gagazette, which I picked up off the clock. Alright, the second trial of Gagazette. Hit the three panels simultaneously. Check each size before deciding who to send. Okay, so basically, uh... Whose ass will fit into uh, one of these glowy circles? I believe, uh, let's see. I believe Riku goes in this one. Titus, into the blue. And uh, Waka, where do you think you should go? Yeah? Are you deciding? <laughs> Way to go, champ. You're smart. Okay, and bingo. Buka. A random battle for me. And a treasure chest! Make up your decision. Come on! Nice. Ah! Look at all these little fish. Should we attack the fish? Well, Titus really won't do anything, will he? Haste! Let's attack the little fish. They're like little piranhas. Little piranhas. Oh, don't self-destruct on me! It's a fish that explodes, of course. It's science. I'm glad there's not real fish out there that can explode on command. That is some serious fucked up shit. Ugh. All right, let's uh, let's get out of here. So now I'm gonna go back to the right, and after I do that, then it's uh, it's a little backtracking, and then we can get the hell out of here. All right, no time for fish. I am not in the mood for fish. I like fish. I like to eat fish. Who likes to eat fish? Let's talk about fish. Eating fish. A fillet of fish. Fiosh. Fish. Fish. Okay. What is your favorite fish to eat? I don't think I'd eat those things on the right. Yeah, that that thing. Ooh. Those things look poisonous, man. I don't think that'd be good cooking. You know what I'm saying? Like toxic. Riku's dead. Oh no. I'm gonna leave her dead. What the fuck do I care? Yeah, run swim away. Run swim. Good fish. I had some, uh, let's see, the latest fish I ate recently was, uh, barramundi, I believe. From, uh, from Australia. Australia. Barramundi. That was good. Okay, so as you can see, to the left of me, there's a path that is opened up. And, uh, oh, hello there. Oh, yeah, the behemoths. Always a pain in the ass. Okay, yeah, I see you. I've noticed you. Let me leave. Is 
Let's see if I can walk down here a little bit. You know what I'm gonna do? Oh, uh, formation. Take a hike. I believe I can go down this path now. Ambushed? These guys are dicks. Oh, God. Nuisances. These guys are nuisances. They really make you pay, don't they? Okay, so we're gonna... Oh, well, Riku's back then. We're gonna get back into the water and we're gonna go down this way now. This is the last path until, you know, as I showed you, we go upstairs. Hmm. Couple chests. Recovery ring. Ugh, get that. A return sphere. Can I return to a part of the map? Can I use the sphere that way? That'd be nice. Swim, Titus, swim. Titus is doing his breaststroke. Do your breaststroke, Titus. Do your breaststroke. Okay. Um. Hmm. I guess I'll touch the save sphere. I'm gonna touch it. I touched it. Uh. Ooh. Okay. Cool. Hi, big blob. Is this thing missing an eye, or is it just covered in darkness? Hmm. I can't tell. What happened to your eye, buddy? Waka, do not go in front of Titus. Riku makes this hard enough. Stop that. Alright, here we go. I'm gonna go over here now. Hey, look, rocks now. And a chest. Yep, there you go. Oh, let's get this. Pep talk. I believe that's equipment for Waka. Woof! Protected from the elements. <laughs> uh, okay. One last thing. Uh, actually, I'm not sure if I remember right about it, but I think the pathway over here now, back in the water, is opened up. And that is that's the last path, I believe. And then we can go up, up and out. Up and out of here. I'm not 100% sure. I don't remember. Let's go back and check. What's the worst that can happen? You know, besides 10 extra random battles. Let's see, is there something to this now? I can't recall. Get out of the water. Ah. Oh, uh, there's chests there. I can't recall how to get those ones. Ah, oh, shot. I really can't. Is it further up? Do I have to go further up again? God damn. I thought I took care of everything. Well, then it's gotta be up around this corner then. It's gotta be back this way. Is it? You can see the paths on the map. Now they kind of uh, intersect and lay on top of each other. Ugh, Riku. Ugh, damn it. Annoying. You're annoying, Gail. There's nothing else to do over here. There's the path above me that you see. I believe that's what leads us out of here. Should I just be like the hell with it? Hmm, I'm thinking. I might write it off. You know, it's funny to me as areas go. This one doesn't stick out in my mind. Why do you think that is? 
you know, like, you got, a uh, Gagazette. And I suppose technically, like, yeah, this is kind of a part of Gagazette, but, ah. I just count the mountains. This is... This is the caves after Gagazette. Fuck that. But this... This portion has never stuck out to me in, like, the... The ten-ish plus years I've played this game. I mean, you have the Comlands, and you have, uh, I don't know... Kilika, or Luka, or whatever you want to use. This place isn't memorable to me, I don't know why. I think because I always try and pass through as quick as possible. Usually, I don't even bother picking up the chests. Oops. Got stuck. Hello, guys! Ambushed! Ouch! Ouchies! Ha! <laughs> Comrade. Oh, good God. I think I'm gonna head up and we'll see what happens. Maybe I'll come in contact with another bridge or something. Ugh. Ugh. Damn! It's the same bastards, too. They're, like, following me. Alright, well, let's go this way. So obnoxious. Hey, uh, Riku, go around back and pull his tail. Seriously, nothing bad will happen. It'd be hilarious. It would. It'd be pretty funny. They're doing it on purpose. Like, I wish you guys could uh, see me shake my head in disgust. Like, it's just, every time I just shake my head. Stop deliberately putting more random battles in this area just because it's this area. It's really obnoxious. Uh, okay. Uh, so what do you guys think? Is there something else? Just the hell with it. I'm going upstairs. That's what I'm doing. Wow! Say, is that edible? You know what I hate? I hate Jello. I've never been a big fan of Jello. I wonder where I got that from. Hmm. I guess we'll never know. Random thought, I suppose. Just always have found Jello to be disgusting. Who likes Jello? Why? It's so stupid and unnecessary. What does it do for you? Okay. The only thing that's good about Jello, some of you might be posting comments, but I'm gonna stop. Well, I'm not gonna stop you, but the one good thing about Jello is. Come on, am I gonna say what you're thinking? Eh, eh, eh? Jello shots! Oh, there you go. And, you know, even then, I, I kinda don't like it. I consider it, like, gross. Jello shots. I mean, it's like, oh, it's Jello, gross. Oh, this is weird and. Pointless, this gross food product, and then you got, oh, there's liquor inside. Well, I guess I'll just put up with it. How the hell did that get popular? I am gonna research jello shots after I'm done this video. They'll be upon us soon. She has sent fiends to test our summoner's strength. Who is she? Unaleska. Lady Unaleska. In Xanarkin, she awaits the arrival of the strongest. She is still alive? As much as Micah and Seymour. I see. Lost your nerve? No. Nothing frightens me now. <laughs> Braska would be proud. Then I must not let him down. Yeah, you know, the whole gang's counting on you. <laughs> all right. Does anyone ever do that hand motion Titus does where, all right, everyone lift up your left arm, you know, like that, make the fist, all right, and then bring it down, like, mmm, yeah, fist, bring it down, fist, bring it down, yeah, we're gonna do this, fist, bring it down. <sighs> Titus, enough with it. 
fist. Bring it down. Machina. And hopefully that'll be the last random battle for the video. Save Sphere, charge. Save Sphere for a reason. Customize. Mm, I'm looking good. Alright, let's get out of this hole. Oh, you bastard. I wonder what uh, Final Fantasy part, and I'm talking about every single Final Fantasy game I've uh, done a walkthrough over the years. I wonder which part, you know, which just single part has the most random battles on it. Completed or fleed from, it doesn't matter. Just the the part with the most random battles. FF4, 6, 10, 13, 13, 2, 7, 9. Oh, good lordy. It comes. Hi, guy. Okay, this is the Sanctuary Keeper. He's got high physical and magic defense. And high physical and magic defense. And a lot of HP. There you go, now you know. So here's uh, the strategy for this guy. He can be kind of a dick. But we'll get, we'll get around it. I will do some shit. First of all, let's use people who suck. Like you, you suck. I'm gonna switch Kamari in first, actually. Um, actually, scan skill. Can't do that. Why not? Might as well. All right. Who else sucks? I'm not gonna use a lot. Uh, you know, I don't think I'm gonna use Lulu too much. Let's just do uh, an attack here. Yeah, not that great. Alright, so there you go. Okay, here comes the Photon Wings. Primarily what I'm going to be doing in this battle is using the Eunice Aeons. They're all charged up, by the way. Okay, so ouch, that sucked right there. Okay, now I gotta... Get some healthy people in here. Yeah, like, uh, the creature's attacks can really suck, as you can see. better heal everything. Okay, good. Yeah, this this bastard inflicts status ailments on me. It's a big pain in the ass. As you can see. Uh, Waka. Let's put him in. Titus. Uh, we're gonna do a little haste dagger. Give us some haste. All right, so here we go. What I'm gonna do now is uh, I'm actually gonna cast Reflect on the monster because the monster will heal himself. And before I do any summoning, I'm not even gonna demonstrate how he heals himself. I'm gonna cast Reflect right away. I'm gonna cast Reflect on him. Uh, on him, oh, on him, thank you. So every time you know, if he'll attempt to use Cure on himself, bounces off of him, of course, on the me. Yeah, that's right, folks. It's one of those reflect boss battles. Final Fantasy reflect boss battles. Uh, it's been a typical kind of trend in the Final Fantasy series. All right, so what am I doing? Let's see. Uh, I can inflict Dark on him. That's good. See, and that's good, too. Kind of would like to get Orin in there on a hit, just in case. I want to get Orin in on a hit. Let's see, what can I do? I bet he's resistant to this. Oh! Happy birthday. I'm going to put Yuna back in, actually. Okay. 
birthday. So yeah, as you can see, hello, happy birthday. Let's just, let's go right on it. I have Reflect Casted on him. I'm gonna use my Bahamut's Overdrive. And uh, he's fucked. He's not gonna be able to heal himself. I got him by the balls. Is Dave prepared? Oh yeah, make your entrance. That's great, man. Looking good. Yeah, really, this this sanctuary keeper protector guy can really slaughter you if uh, you don't got things lined up. The key to winning the battle is, you know, cast reflect on him and then summon your Aeons. And uh, a couple other things, but we'll get to it as they happen in this battle. If they happen. What's the damage? That's cool looking. That's nice. Oh, yeah. God, I got you. Yeah, that didn't work out either. Oh, here comes the mana breath. Oh, no. He's casting Reflect on me. I gotta dismiss him right away. He's gotta get out of there. What can I do? He's gotta go. He cast Reflect on me. He's gonna try and heal himself by, uh, by casting it on, uh, well, on Bahamut, but he's gone. So, yeah, he's still got Reflect. None of my characters have Reflect. Uh, if one... If the monster here is going to cast Reflect on, you know, Orn or Titus or something, I'll just go to Yuna and I'll dispel the, uh, the status. Anyway, what am I doing? I am, uh... Do it. There you go. Oh, he's immune. Oh, here it comes. So, yeah, he just casted, uh, Reflect on Yuna. He's going to try and attempt to heal himself. Fuck that. There we go. And so much for that. Oh, you are screwed, bitch. I'm not going to summon anyone else. Yeah, go on. Give me your best shot. I'm putting the controller down. I just need one hit. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Someone wake up. I need someone to wake up. Orn? Thank you. Oh, good lord. Okay. Now he's dead. Did I get cocky at the end? Yeah. He was done. I was fine. Oh, that is an ugly bitch. Goodbye. A bit. Soon means that there's not much time left. Riku. Fine. I'll think on the way. Yeah, there we go. Another return sphere. Hey, come on. Let's go. We are. We're almost there, aren't we? Mm. We've come a long way. <laughs> What's so funny? You remind me of myself. Hmm? Before, the closer I came to Xanarkin, the more I wondered. When we arrive, Brasco will call the final Aeon. He will fight Sin, then die. I thought my mind was made up long before. But when I stood here, my resolve wavered. Hmm. Never would have figured. Legendary Guardians choke sometimes too, yeah? <laughs> Legendary Guardian? I was just a boy. A boy about your age, actually. I wanted to change the world too. But I changed nothing. That is my story.
Well, that's kind of depressing, don't you think? Orin kind of just telling us how, uh, pretty much didn't really accomplish anything, and nothing seemed to work out. Oh, look at this place. High mountains. And it looks like we are out of Gagazette, folks. Finally. As you can see, the snow is gone. No more. And we're nearing our destination, which is Xanarkind at last. Things are gonna get crazy. Oh yeah, and uh, Titus is a dream. So there's that too. I don't know. Maybe we'll see what happens on the next part. It's gonna be good. But right now, guys, I think I'm gonna call it a wrap. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe and comment. I am Dave the Usher for the Game Replay. Stay tuned for the next part of Final Fantasy X. I will see you guys next time. I am out.